Hi guys, my name is Amir Shahzad and this is my second video on Leica Total Station TS02 and these are the videos uh, make on the request which I showed in the previous videos. So in second video I am going to talk same you know, on the setting and second option. When we power on the Total Station this is our first appearance base and the number 5 we have a setting. So simply uh, bring on the setting and press the enter key. After enter the settings, you can find six different kind of settings. Yesterday we already talked about work. Now the second is the region. So simply I bring on the region key and then press enter. After enter, I'm inside the regional settings. So regional settings, you can see there is a uh, three pages. So we can talk one by one all these settings. So first is the HZ increment. HZ increment is mean what is showing the azimuth or angle on the display. If this is the right, it's mean when you go for the clockwise, it's going to plus uh, in, in, increase the values of the angle. And if you go anti-clock, it will be reduce the uh, azimuth or uh, bearings. So for example, now currently is the right side. If I go with the same right, continue and if I enter in the uh, programs in survey and then if I move my total station to the right direction you can see uh, my horizontal uh, azimuth is increasing in the right side and if I go for the left side it will be decrease so this we call right or right face or right side so I am again going to the setting option in the regional enter now I will change right to left so I press F4 for the continue escape uh, with the escape key I come out from the settings and enter in the program file enter in the survey F4 for the continue now if I move my total station clockwise you can see there is a different because before it was increase no is decrease so I'm going to escape again with the settings regional settings I'll change in the previous in the right so in the regional settings we have a second option vertical setting vertical setting means this is our telescope if we move in the vertically he showed three types of the uh, angles first one as you see in the display is called uh, Zen this is mean regular we have our uh, angles like degree and minutes first we will see how it's appear it's a look like if we go into uh, if we enter in the survey option for if I move my telescope you can see this is moving and this showing V in degree, minutes and second. I press the escape key, come out from this one again, enter the setting option, regional and this time I press horizon. Once I press horizon, it will be uh, divided in the four parts. F4 for continue, escape, enter in the survey, F4 now you can see once I move my telescope for example downward after 90 it will be changed it's not moving in the 360 it's only maximum 90 degree now the third option in this up settings is percentage slow percentage if I use this slope option, it will be showing me uh, all uh, this angle in slope. This slope is start from the like a telescope in a horizontal position like 0 or 90 and then downwards with the prism this angle shows in the percentage. I am entering the program file and then survey start. Now you see, you can see the vertical angle is showing in a percentage. 
so these three options are in original setting for the vertical telescope uh, angle again I'm entering the setting regional and the uh, I change in the vertical settings in the first option and then press continue again I'm entering in the regional settings the third option is here hold hold mean once I take some readings uh, on the side with the prism after uh, <coughs> after record or measure the uh, readings it will be show some reading on the display and survey and this will be hold whatever we observe from the site it will not change until we go for the next uh, points it's mean hold if I change into the running it's mean once I appear uh, for example if I press, uh, press distance option and there is the some values and if I move this total station little bit it will be change the values so this is a difference between running and hold so I always keep in the hold so hold is better why because once we take the reading sometime we delay the work it will not change if we take some time for the record this data in our uh, once we note some data so I'm interested in the second page with the press uh, with the uh, with the key of page here we have uh, options uh, angular units like now is showing degree minute and seconds we can change into gone and degree decimals degree decimal degrees you can see there is a four digits of a point so mostly we are using in the survey degree minutes and units if you need if you have any required for example sometime if uh, we guys get some drawings in only digit uh, digit uh, in decimal digits angle so we can change here the settings in the angular see the minimum reading it can read this total session one seconds units are in meters and the decimals are three units after point is a three we can change for as our required like uh, US foot international foot and meters because on Y side we are using the foot so I keep as a foot, uh, meter after decimals we have a uh, three points same if you see we can change this in three to four or two so as my side required three so I'm using three downside we have a temperature in the degrees we can change in foreign heights so after temperature units we have an option for the pressure pressure and we have a grade in the vertical and horizontal ratio and if I go for the third page here we can find the set over time settings this last we have a format for this uh, date like day month and years we can change also into month date and years and years month and date whatever format we like we can utilize with the this arrow keys we can change and after we selected our required format and then simply press F4 for the continue so these are the regional settings which one I share with you Hope you understand these things. If you have any question related to this video or another video, you can ask me in the comments box. Thanks for watching. Take care.